Eccles now leads 47-42 at the break. Chris Mykoski inside Stouffer Gymnasium, and we've been talking about it during the entire broadcast, this amazing pipeline between Nichols basketball and Australia and New Zealand. It's something J.P. Piper has been working on throughout his entire time here in Colonel Country. A lot of his recruiting is emails and phone calls. He has made two trips over the Oceanic region, but really what this continued success is predicated upon is trust. Here's Bryant Johnson. The bright beaches of Australia and New Zealand invite the curious to dream big. Liam Thomas and Zach Young have long imagined themselves as international basketball players. Now their dream is a reality. Not many people get the opportunity to go to a different country, play top level basketball in college. America is everywhere everyone wants to go and if you make it you gotta represent where you come from. In the last 10 years, more than 20 Oceana players have represented the red and gray. Word of mouth recruiting has changed the way the Colonel coaching staff targets international players. In Liam's case, we were able to put Liam's parents in contact with Anatoly's parents. Anatoly's parents in touch with Stefan Blazinski's parents. And then here recently, Jaden Weldon put his parents in touch with Liam Thomas's parents. So there's been this trust that's been developed because the parents on the other side of the ocean are talking to one another. Trust is what led Liam and Zach to Nichols. Last week, in the midst of an eight-day conference road trip, the two weren't on the shores of Bondi Beach or Scorching Bay. It was Corpus Christi, Texas, playing host to two native sons of the South Pacific. Walking on the beach of Corpus Christi, haven't been to a beach in a while, so that was great. I just brought back memories of home and it was a great rally and uh, never really thought that Playing a conference road trip, you get to experience something like that, but we did, and I'm grateful for that. The South Pacific Partnership has benefited all involved, but it's the people who make it possible. Enough good people behind you will get you where you need to be. Most recently, we just signed Jackson Stent. When I was growing up, people didn't really think this could, this could happen. Like, bit like New Zealanders could come over and compete on this American level. Stephen Adams is a great example. He's made all the way to the NBA. Um, we got a whole bunch of college athletes, both girls and boys, over here, which is phenomenal and coming up through the ranks all the young kids and there's a ridiculous amount of young kids that are in New Zealand who haven't even been seen yet. Well Kiwi Pride to me is uh, spending time with your family, having fun, going to the beach, playing sports uh, with your friends and uh, to live on the light side a bit and that's and just embrace, embrace everything and try to find the funny side of things. Basketball brought Zach, Liam and Jackson to the States but the culture of the country is something they've all embraced. It's important to um, experience the culture of a different country and I think uh, the Red Dress Run was a perfect uh, example of that, had a lot of fun. Firstly, to go to the Red Dress Run, you need to find dresses, and that was the first step. So um, we went to the toy section to find tutus, and everything was too small. About one tutu would fit about one, one of Liam's legs. I feel like I have the, the best legs in Southland, so I feel like I want to show them off. It gives you uh, an insight of what, I guess, women go through every day. Um, they want to show off the legs. I wanted to show off my legs, too. Basketball is a priority, but just coming to this culture, the south, the south it's, uh, everyone's very friendly and stuff, and a lot of opportunities to have some fun. And all those young men out there aspiring to play college ball, I would say chase your dreams, to work hard, you know, and hopefully our paths will cross at some point in the future and you get an opportunity to maybe be a colonel someday. Liam Thomas then feeds Nick Bell. The two Aussies getting it done that position. One Australian to another, what a play.